Have you ever seen a perfect match between art and nature? We did, at the Verbeke Foundation in Kemzeke of all places, where successful businessman Geert Verbeke started to collect art 20 years ago. Today he has a vast collection open to the public, and the foundation also has a platform for new artists. The Verbeke Foundation doesn't really have a concept. It's, you have to see it as the backyard of Geert Verbeke. So what he likes in art, you can find here. Some people will say there are dodgy and morbid things, and other people will see the concept of art inside. Not all pieces of art you can find in the foundation are really something to put in your living room. I won't do that either, even Geert Verbeke won't do that. But it's the idea behind it that makes it an artwork. Nowadays I really, I really love art, but I, when I was younger I always remember my my parents had used to force me to go to art museums and stuff, and I just screamed and complained for like the entire time. But I think if anything, as I've grown older, you really learn to appreciate the modern stuff because art is a way to create the images in your mind or have outlets for your various neuroses and stuff. This guy seems like the sort of kid you avoid. Your parents told you to avoid yeah, as a child. Possible, don't, yeah, don't, yeah. don't go play with him. He puts animals in old fridges or something. Now we go outside. We have a 12-acre domain. Oh, this is gorgeous. One of our uh, prime artworks outside is the Kazanus by Joop van Lieshout. Oh, I think I'd, I'd heard about this. It's an intestine. I heard this is a hotel room? Yeah. So I can, I can stay in, in Yeah, the... it's a bed and breakfast. Oh, you it's have not any... a door though, huh? Was... You have every... every... <laughs> there's a, there's a, there's a little sorry, spider there's... in the anus, yeah. Uh, Oh, that's, that's, that's a frequent problem. But you problem. have all oh, luxury inside you need. You have a double bed, you have a shower, you have a you toilet. Can, so. Really? You, you drape the branches across and they grow? Five years, everything will be strong enough. It can be cleaned out in the middle. Is there more back? Oh, oh, here's this. Oh my God. This is really lovely. It feels really open. The atmosphere of the Verbeke Foundation, it's, you know, it's kind of passionate and yet very laid back. I think, you know, they care a lot about what they do and then the art they have and, and nurturing it and letting it grow. But at the same time, all this nature just it creates an environment where it's, you can't help but relax. I think Verbeke, it's a little bit off the beaten path, but a lot of times some of the best things are the ones on the paths that have grown a little bit over. It's almost like not, not a forest or a jungle, but you know, it's overgrown. You wouldn't even think of it being here. And then when you discover it, it's like an oasis in the desert. Maybe just one 